in the Roblox game. Hi, bro. Are you finally willing to play the game? Yeah, I want to try it once. That's good. I want to introduce you to my friends. As you can see, I'm bacon right now. They won't tease me just because of this, right? Don't worry. They are all good people. They won't care about how much Robux you have. Actually, there is a girl. Oh, I see. But she's always just joking around. Don't worry. Oh, okay. Well, you can go ahead and add me. Okay. In the group chat. Hello, everyone. I'm back. Where did you go? You missed Neil's joke. He looks so funny. Ear, who the hell is this? Why is there bacon in our group? Um, I am. Ugh, don't talk to me. A poor, ugly, useless bacon like you is not classy enough to talk to me. Oh my god. Stop. Vania. This is Phil. He is my best friend. Please show him some respect. Yeah, I'm fine. Don't pay attention to what she says. By the way, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I was just joking, but nice to meet you. Nice to meet you all. Okay, let's introduce ourselves a little, so everyone can understand each other better. What do you guys think about the face reveal? Sure. Okay, I will go first. You all know who I am, but my name is Jeremy. I'm 17, I use any pronoun, and this is me. Your style like your is very cool. Haha, -ha, you are all so nice, thank you. I want to go next. My name is Neil, and I'm 16. This is me. I you are cool, style. bro. You are freaking hot. All I want is you. Please marry me. Oh, wow. Vania. Um, I mean... Okay, anyway, my turn. My name is Gina. I'm 16. And I look like this. Nice I love your hair you color. color. I've ever known. My turn. I'm Phil. I'm 17. My pronoun is he or him and this is me. You still look great as always. Yeah, you are so cute. Even though I don't like you very much, I have to admit that you have a pretty beautiful smile. Haha, <laughs> thank you. I'll take that as a compliment. Okay everyone, please focus on me. Last but not least, you will be able to admire my beauty. You are really confident about yourself. Shut up, you ugly bacon. Look at me. Hi, my name is Vanya, and this is me. Wow, she is really beautiful. You look hot, girl. Yeah, so slay. I like you so much. Thank you all, I know I'm pretty. But anyway, thank you for your compliments. Do you guys want to play games? Let's play Dahood together. Yeah. yeah. Are you okay? Yeah, luckily, you came to save me in time. If it weren't for you, I would have lost. Thank you so much. You are welcome. We are friends. Don't look at Gina with those passionate eyes anymore. You don't want to get into trouble. My heart has already been given to another girl. So you guys don't need to argue. Come on, let's quickly return to the group chat. Everyone is waiting for us. In the group chat. Woohoo! It was really fun playing the game today. Phil, I saw you almost lose a few times. That's right. Luckily, Gina came to help me. By the way, Gina, I have something to say to you. Sure, what do you want to say? I had to be honest. Gina, I think you're super cute and hot, like hotter than everyone else in this group chat. No offense, Vania. I know you're more interested in girls, but if you want to meet a boy, I'm right here. Oh wow, that's so sweet. I'm so sorry to tell you this. I gave myself enough time to understand my sexual orientation. And I've discovered that I'm not really into men at all. Okay, I totally understand. I just want to tell you my feelings. Sorry, if I made you uncomfortable. It's fine, don't worry. Phil, can I private chat with you real quick? Oh, um, sure, Neil. In the private chat. What the hell are you doing? Back the a off. Huh? What do you mean? What did I do to make you angry? It seems like you still don't realize the stupid thing you did. So, can you tell me what it's about? Gina is mine. I don't want to see you talking with her at all. Or I will find you and hunt you down. Do I make myself clear? And if you tell anyone about this, 
I will find your IP address and send it to them. What's wrong with you? Are you serious? You act like you're only 8 years old. I don't accept trifles with a kid like you. Also, Gina just told us she was a lesbian. I'm going to make sure that changes. Eight and homophobic, dude, you are weird. I'm not homophobic. Also, I'm not eight. Shut your a mouth. You're trying to make a girl stop being gay so she'll like you. That sounds homophobic to me. And at your age, no one is obsessed with someone like that. Ugh, I will not argue with you about that again. You know what? I'm gonna tell everyone what you're telling me. Haha, ha, no one will believe you. Besides that, if you do, I will find you anyway. Whatever, I will tell everybody. Back into the group chat. And then I said, Guys, I have something to tell you. Oh, Phil, you are back. Ugh, you stupid bacon, you're interrupting me. I should have kicked you out of here. Fine, do what you want, but I need to tell you all something important. Oh, what is this? Hold on, where is Neil? That's exactly what I'm going to say. Neil threatened to find out my address. He will come there to harm me, and will leak my home address to everyone. All because I confessed my love to Jenny. He warned me not to tell anyone, but I don't think I should hide it. So what do you do when your friend threatens to harm you out of jealousy? Ha ha ha, no way. What are you talking about? This is just a joke, right? I don't think Neil would say those things. No, I'm serious. You must believe me. So you're trying to tell me that the boy I've known for six years and liked for four years is threatening you? What's a joke? So you guys want proof, right? I will show you his true face. Phil leaves and realizes his message with Neil is gone. What the hell? Why did that message disappear? Phil's other messages also gradually disappeared. Oh, I understand. Did that guy hack me? I can't believe it. I have to tell the others. Meanwhile, with the rest of the group. What do you guys think? Is it a prank? I don't know. She sounded pretty serious. Yeah, me too. Oh, come on, dude. Why are you even defending him? She's pretty easy to read, though. Whatever. I won't let a newbie destroy the relationship between me and the boy I like. Guys, you won't believe this. My messages with Neil are gone, and other chats are too. I think he's hacking me and deleting all of my chats. Okay, now I am sure that can't be real. You really thought that we would believe you? What I say is true. I don't know how to prove it to you guys. I swear I'm not joking. I've never been as serious as I am now. I'll find Neil to prove that what I said is true. Phil, that's enough. Oh right, it was fun at first, but it's gone too far. You can't keep lying like this. Surely everything was made up by him. Are you jealous of Neil because I like him and not you? Girl, what you just said is more absurd than what I'm saying. And most of all, I'm very serious. I'll find Neil and make him tell you the truth. Neil, here you are. This stupid bastard keeps telling lies about you. Hey, who do you think you are? How dare you hack me and get me in trouble like this? Let them know what happened between you and... Phil the best 12 has been kicked. What? He's been kicked out of the group. Jeremy, are you that angry? I've never seen you kick anyone out of the group. No, that's not me. I also don't understand what just happened. So, who kicked him? I did it. I'm a hacker. What? what? I hacked into Jeremy's account and made myself an administrator in this group chat. Now I'm going to go find that bastard Phil. 555 Mutton Town Road. So this is his home address. You should have believed what he said. Because now you will lose him forever. But don't worry, I'll be back soon. And make Gina madly in love with me. So babe, wait for me. You will be mine and no one is allowed to touch you. What the hell just happened? Is, is he really in love with me? I wish he was talking about me, but... Guys! Phil wasn't joking. Everything he tells us about threatening or hurting is true. The address Neil gives us is Phil's house. What? Are you serious? Please tell me it's a joke. Please tell me that the boy I love more than anything isn't insane. And willing to KL a boy for a girl he likes. A girl that isn't me. Vanya, this is not the time for jokes. My best friend is in danger. But are you sure it's Phil's house? 
Maybe he just took a random address from the fake address websites? Yeah, I'm sure. I have been friends with Phil since we were toddlers. And I've been over to his house numerous times. I know where the he lives. But what if? No. I meant. No, Vania. Just stop that. Do you understand this situation? My best friend of almost 15 years is in danger. Just because your crush is crazy jealous. And you still act like nothing. I need you to take this shit seriously. I do take it seriously. And I also know that there's a chance that Neil isn't going to do anything. Vania, he literally sent us Phil's address. What the hell does he have to do unless there's malicious intent? You two need to meet me at that address in two hours. I know you to live in Washington, so please help him or help me. I don't understand. Why did everything turn out like this? What should we do now? Have you seen how sad and scared Jeremy is? Just like Jeremy said, we have to go to Phil's house and help him. I don't want to go there. I'm very confused now. The guy I liked for so long turned out to be a crazy guy. What am I supposed to do now? What we need to do now is go help Jeremy. He really needs your help. But I don't even know Phil. But you know Jeremy, right? And you care about him. We need to get over there and help both of them. For Jeremy. If not for Phil, it would be for Jeremy. I'm going too. Then, I guess, I'll see you there, girl. I'll see you there. Drive safely. You too. Meanwhile, with Phil in real life, why was I kicked out of the group like this? Could it be that Jeremy did that? Nah, he would never do that. It was definitely Neil's doing. Huh, Jeremy's message? Let me see what he texted. Phil, please tell me you are still safe. What's wrong? Neil sent us your address. He knows where you live. You need to hide. Oh my god, are you serious? Damn it, he's gonna me don't worry too much me and the others are coming to your house now go lock all the doors and stay in your room when i get there you can open the door should i call the police no we'll handle it please just stay safe until we get there we'll be there as soon as possible okay i understand oh my god i'm done maybe i should lock the door like jeremy said hopefully they can get here in time i don't know what i should do if i see neil right now I should lock all the doors quickly. After he locks everything but the front door. Okay, just have only front door, I will be safe. Hello dude, it's not too difficult to find you. Neil, why are you here? Calm down, we can talk slowly. Looks like you ignored my warning. Haven't I told you the price of disobeying me? Come on. Things are not that serious, and you don't need to carry such a weapon. Stop talking nonsense. Today, I will give you a lesson. No, get away from me. Come back here. Gina! Oh, hi, Jeremy. I didn't think you would come so early. Yeah, I had tried my best. After all, I also have some responsibility here. So I can't let you come alone. And I want to help you as much as I can by making sure Phil is okay. Thank you so much, Gina. That means a lot to me. We're friends, right? So it's okay. I think we should go inside. The door's been busted down or something. I think Neil got here first. Oh shit, I didn't notice it. Let's come inside. Inside the house. What happened? Why does everything look like such a mess? Phil, where are you? We are here, please appear quickly. It's not okay, I don't see him answering me. Oh no, no, please tell me that can be true. Did we come too late? No, I don't want to think about that. Let's just keep looking. Well, you don't need to waste your time looking for him. It's amazing to see you two coming here. Oh God, Phil, are you okay? What did he do to you? Ah, I feel pain everywhere, but at least I'm still alive. Shut up. You already know what happens next? Neil, you can't do this. Why not? This shit wants you for himself. And I will never let that happen. I have said many times that I don't like Phil. 
Why don't you understand that? I've said it many times, but he doesn't believe it. Shut your mouth. I'm not done with you yet. Neil, stop, please. That's enough, Neil. I don't like him. He's just my friend. So, let him go. He's still an obstacle to our relationship. I won't let anything ruin it. I'm lesbian. I like girls. I don't like boy. Do you understand? I can't like you. But, that's so unfair. I loved you since the day we met. You can't treat me like that. That's not how it works. I'm sorry, Neil. I can't come back from this, can I? Nope. Look what you did to me. It's all your fault. If you hadn't shown up and ruined me and Gina's relationship, then I wouldn't do this either. It's best for you to disappear. Wait, please. No, don't. Neil, no. Are you guys okay? Vanya. Vanya. Thank you. But you just hit him with a pan. Yeah, what else can I do? When I arrived, your house looked like a mess. Then I saw Neil trying to attack you. So I think I need to do something. Oh my god, that moment really scared me. If it weren't for Vanya, I don't know what would happen. But I don't think hitting someone with a frying pan is a good idea. But luckily you came in time. Thank you. I thought you wouldn't come. You guys are my friends. How could I abandon you? But thanks to that, I can clearly see his true face. How could he be such a possessive and extreme person? Ugh, now I don't understand why I like him. So does that mean you consider me a friend? You touched me so much. No, I never said that. I'm only helping you because you're Jeremy's friend. You don't need to say anything more, I can understand. Um, guys, I think we should bring him to the hospital now. We don't know how hard Vanya hit him. Gina is right. I will call the police and prepare some stuff. And then we will come to the hospital to check his condition. Oh God, what are we gonna tell the police? We need to be honest with them. I'm sure they'll understand. Now make sure he doesn't die. I will be right back. Two days later. I'm glad it's finally over. There's nothing serious about Neil. He just needs to rest for a few days and he'll be fine. How about you, Phil? Have you gone for a health check yet? Yeah, except for a few bruises, I'm fine. Finally, while waiting for us to arrive, what did he do to you? Um, he came and yelled at me. Then he started destroying things. I was also injured while trying to stop him. As for the rest, you already know. Luckily, he hasn't taken this problem too seriously. By the way, where is Neil? He is in room 601. He still has to stay in the hospital for a few days to monitor his condition. Because he was hit quite hard by someone with a pan. Hey, stop talking about it. I know my actions are not right. But at that time I had no other choice. If you were me, what would you do? I think she is right. That's the best she can do. Will you be punished for telling the police about your actions? They just warned me not to do it again. And I'll have to write a report and do community service for a few days. I'm sorry. It's my fault that you have to be punished. It's okay. Don't feel guilty. You guys are Neil's friends, right? He's woken up and wants to see you guys. That's right. We are his friends. We are also preparing to visit him. I've heard about your story. This will probably be a memorable experience for you. So if you don't want to come in, I won't force you either. Go see him when you really feel like it. I understand. Thank you. Okay, that's what I want to say. I have to go now. If you need any assistance, please call me. What do you think? Should we come? Of course. I have to go in there and scold him. How could he do that to his friend? We've been friends with him for six years now. I can't abandon him. I will go with you. I also have a lot to tell him. What about you two? Will you come in? Um, I, I. You guys go in first, we'll go in later. Okay, sure. Take your time. How do you feel, Phil? Do you want to meet him? I don't know. I feel very awkward. And also a little bit scared. You know, this is the first time I've experienced this situation. 
Now I don't think I can be in the same room with someone who tried to attack me. Don't worry, you're safe now. And I think Neil has had enough time to rethink his actions. Besides, I'm by your side now. I won't let him hurt you anymore. Thank you, bro. I really appreciate it. All right, let's go visit him. Why did it take you guys so long? Calm down, they were here. Sorry for the long wait. It's fine, at least you finally came. Phil, Neil has something to tell you. Um, Phil, I am happy to see you fine. I know what I've done to you is unforgivable. I have caused you a lot of pain. I hope that I have a chance to make up for it in the future. And I'm so sorry. Really, really sorry you. I can say this was a horrifying experience for me. But you already have this apologetic attitude. I can't do anything else. Don't do that again from now on. And you look friendly without intent to kill someone. Haha, <laughs> thank you. All you guys are so nice. Thank you guys for forgiving me. The end. In the private chat? Babe, you're here. Where are you? Susan, you're online? I saw the green dot right next to your name. What are you doing? Why don't you answer me? Can I borrow 10,000 Robux? What is she doing that she isn't answering me? One hour later. Susan, hello. Hmm, maybe she is busy, I guess. But she is online. Why doesn't she answer me? Okay, fine. I won't text you anymore. Well, I should stop bother her then. Another one hour later. In the group chat. Oh my god, that was so much fun. We have to start playing together more. Hold on, stupid Adam is texting me. I will be right back with you, sweetie. Um, but I'm Adam. What are you talking about? Am I stupid? How so? Are you talking to someone but not me? Oh, shat shat shat. Wrong private chat. Why am I so careless? Stupid me. Oh my god, I have to make excuses for this. It was a prank, baby. It's nothing. Don't mind it. I just want to have fun moment. Really? Is that so? Who were you talking to? And who were you playing with? Shat, he will know the truth anyways. Well, I should tell him the truth or keep lying. What should I do? Dang it, I was so careless. Oh, he is just an old friend of mine. You don't have to worry about him. And it was a prank, Adam? I want to believe you, Susan, but I need to hear words from him. I want to know this is all just prank. Can you add him here? Why? Do you not believe me? Add him right now. I won't ask second time, Susan. Ugh, fine. Wait me a second. I hope he would understand the assignment. Miguel has been added to the group chat. Hey there, beautiful girl. Were it fun earlier? Miguel, stop it. Beautiful girl? Who are you calling beautiful girl? That's right. Why are you calling me that? Because you're my girlfriend. Of course, duh. Girlfriend, huh? Miguel, stop talking nonsense. She's my girlfriend, dude. Stay away from her. I swear right now. Stop playing with me, Susan. Bro, calm down. Breath in and breath out. I can see why she cheated on you with me. Actually, you have to say the opposite. I cheated on you with Adam. The F? I'm done with this. I can't believe you're that kind of person, Susan. I'm leaving. I'm tired of hearing this. So we are all over. Shut up, Miguel. You literally ruined everything. I told you to shut your mouth, but you kept saying. And now everything is ruined. I really can't believe what just happened. This is too much for me. Why would she do that? Ain't no way I'm getting back to her. I will leave her for good. I should be looking for a new girlfriend instead of sitting here and feeling sad about her. ABC for a new friend. Hey there, handsome boy. Hey. You're looking for a friend, right? Yeah, I just broke up with my girlfriend. Oh, sorry to hear that. What happened? She cheated on me with another guy. Do you need a shoulder? I'm here for you. Thanks, I'm Adam. I'm Kate. Nice to meet you. Do you want to play something to end this sorrow atmosphere? I can make you happy in a second. Oh really? Let's play. Trust me, I can do this. Kate and Adam join game for a couple of hours. In the private chat? 
Ha ha ha, that was so fun. You're pretty good, Adam. Thanks. You played well too, Kate. I want to thank you for making me forget what happened to me. You really made me forget. Told you I could do it. So, same time tomorrow? Yeah, same time tomorrow. All right. See you tomorrow. Bye, Adam. Um, yeah, I still miss Susan. I need to find more joy to please myself. Adam joins the hood to find another friend. In the hood. Hey there, handsome boy. Wanna play something fun with me? Oh, she's kinda hot. I will talk with her. But I will pretend that I'm sad. Oh, hey. What's wrong? Did I say something bad? Um, no. It's nothing. It's just, um, I, um. I shouldn't probably say it. Hey, you can share with me. It's okay. It's about my ex-girlfriend. We just broke up and I'm sad. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. What happened? She cheated on me with another guy. I didn't do anything wrong to her. It's okay. It's okay. You don't have to cry for her. She's nothing for you to deserve to cry for. I'm here. I'm here. Thank you. I really need a shoulder now. I'm Adam, by the way. I'm Carol. Do you want to play something with me? The hood or um two or something that can cheer you up? Yeah, your choices are my choices. Okay, join me in two. Later that night. Come on, Adam, pick up the phone. What do you want, Susan? Can we talk for a second? What do you want to talk about? You're cheating on me, remember? We're done talking. Hey, I don't want to make things worse than it's already. We're over, Susan. Don't contact me. No, I don't want us to be over. Can we go back? You still want us to be back as used to be after this? Yes, I want. I regret what I did. I love you, Adam. I already broke up with Miguel after I realized I made a mistake. Okay, if that what you want. Great, talk to you later. She's crazy, but if she wants that, I will use her. The next day. Susan, can I borrow 50,000 Robux? What for? I'm in a hurry. I promise I will give you back. We're still friends, right? Yeah. Okay. I will send you. Thanks. Oh, that is the signal. I have to go now. What was that? There you are, Adam. Oh, hey, Kate. Just in time. Can I borrow 10,000 Robux? I'm in a hurry. There is a mission required Robux. Can I borrow yours? Yeah, of course. Here's yours. Thanks. Oh, that is the signal. I have to go now. Huh? What was that? Carol, my sweetie. Oh, I'm already your sweetie. Oh, sorry. If you don't like it, I won't call that name ever again. No, no. I kinda like it. You can call me sweetie. Cool. Can I borrow your Robux? Um, I don't have any, Adam. Sorry for that. Oh, it's okay. It's nothing. Do you want to play something with me? Yeah. Since then, Adam talked to Kate and Carol at the same time. And they all accepted to be his girlfriends, but nobody knows until two months later. Why are you taking so long? Adam, where are you, babe? I was talking to my girlfriend. Oh, um, I mean my girl best friend. Are you cheating on me? No, no, I am not. I love you only. Hum, just be careful with what you're doing, Adam. I will find out someday. So do you want to continue playing? Yeah, yeah, of course. Can you give me 10,000 Robux first? But you just asked me to give you 20,000 Robux yesterday. So what? Just give me. I really need it. Okay, fine. Thanks, babe. I have to go now. Huh? Why did he leave? Hey, I thought we were going to play. Where are you going? Okay, fine. I will join too. In the private chat. Hi, babe. Carol, love. Can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure. What is it? You have been acting so weird today. You keep sneaking, like you're doing something wrong. What happens to you? Tell me, please. Is that true that you're cheating on me? Are you thinking about your ex-girlfriend, right? Why are you mentioning her? Of course not, I didn't think about her. Why would I do that? Okay, I won't ask further. That was a close one. She stops asking. So do you want to play something? Oh, um, yeah, let's play. 
Join meme too. Did Kate Jews say she will play in two? I should avoid playing two to avoid Kate. I don't really like that game. I want to play doors. Oh, sure. Let's play. They join doors. Adam, my baby. Oh, I'm Kate. What are you doing here? I thought you played in two. Oh, I just joined you cause I'm bored playing alone. You're not supposed to be here. What does that mean? Uh, um. Babe, why are you just standing there? Come on, let's play. Babe, what the? Who are you talking to, you over there? Oh, shit. This can't be happening right now. Oh, um, I have to go now. Oh, no, you don't go anywhere. You will be staying here and start to explain. And you, I'm talking to Adam cause he is my boyfriend. Boyfriend? Adam is my boyfriend, not you. What are you talking about? Oh my god, are you cheating on me? No, I didn't do anything wrong. What do you mean? Are you trying to play dumb with me? No, you have been cheating on me the whole time. Yeah, I can't believe you're cheating on me. So what? At least I have a better girlfriend and she is rich and I can use her the whole time. You're just poor, Carol. I use you for nothing. I don't claim to be rich. Oh my god, you're such a horrible person. I couldn't agree more. Such a cheater. Hey girl, can I talk to you in private? Sure. Adam, you stay right here. We will be right back. Whatever. In the private chat? He's not good at all. I can't believe I date him. You're right, but if you're not the rich one, I'm not the rich one also. Then I think he dated three girls at the same time. He has another girlfriend and he is using her cause she is rich. I feel bad for her. And I think I was also scammed by him. He asked me for total 30,000 Robux. Oh my god, this is beyond my imagination. I have an idea. Let's put aside the grudges and help each other. We should help that poor girl. We just can't let him take advantage of us. You're absolutely right. Um, what is your name? I'm Kate. I'm Carol. I can't believe we're friends in this situation. Ha ha ha. We should kick his ass, teach him a lesson. Okay, let's go back to that jerk. Back to Adam. Gosh, this is so wrong. Why is everything happening now? Why are you to talking for so long? It's none of your business, jerk. Anyway, can you add us to your group so we can meet your rich girlfriend? Um, we haven't been talking lately. I don't think she can meet anyone right now. But why would I do that? Just add her. Can you save it for tomorrow? I need to make up with her. No. no. Add her right now. This is an order, not a suggestion. Fine, I will do what you said, princess. Adam, what do you want? Who are these two girls? Hi, Susan. How are you? You didn't answer my question. Who are they? They are, um... Hey there, poor girl. We are his girlfriends and we just found out everything. Really? Is that true, Adam? I don't know. They're talking nonsense. Don't believe them. Susan, right? Can I private chat with you? Carol, you come too. Okay. Don't listen to them, Susan. Oh, I'm sure. Let's private talk. In the private chat? I'm here now. I will introduce ourselves. I'm Kate and this is Carol. And the most important thing, your boyfriend is a cheater. Adam is our boyfriend. He is using us and he is a cheater. You're lying. You're not his girlfriends. Please, you have to believe us. We're telling the truth. Nah, I know he loves me so much. You guys are just jealous cause I have a handsome boyfriend. I know you two are just trying to break us up. Dang it, she didn't believe what we said. Hmm, let's try another solution. We will find something else soon. Now just go back to the group. Back to Adam. Babe, they are saying you are the cheater and you're using me for Robux. Is that really true? Nope, why would I? You cheated on me but I always wanted you to get back to me. Don't believe them, Susan. They're just jealous cuz you and I are dating but they don't. Yeah, that's my point. I just tell them exactly what you just said. Kate Carol, I want to talk to you alone. Susan Babe, would you mind for a second? Sure, honey bear. Listen up brats, do not tell her that I'm using her. 
If she finds out anything, I won't leave you to alone. There will be consequences. You dare us? Ugh, whatever, rat. They're so annoying. I wish I didn't let them meet Susan. So what happened? It's nothing important, baby. Can I have 50,000 Robux? I only can give you 20,000 Robux because 50,000 is too much. That's fine to me. Thanks, I gotta go now. Girl, don't you see what just happened? What just happened? You're really that dumb. He was asking you for Robux, that means he is using you. She's right, he is using you. Ugh, would you stop saying things like that? I'm tired of hearing it. You guys are so annoying. I wish you two are not here. I'm leaving. Ah, uh, finally, they disappear. They're such a bad influence on me. Oh, where is Kate and Carol? You don't need to worry about them anymore. You will never see them again. Oh, why? You know why? Yeah, I think that too. They're not good for you. Yeah. So can I have another 20,000 Robux, please? Oh, sure. Here you are. Let's play him too. Okay. Meanwhile with Kate and Carol. Wow, what's a dummy? She didn't believe us. Maybe he brainwashed her. This is going to be difficult. Well, what should we do now? Let's deal with it later. I have to clear my mind so I can think easily. This will be a plan that he will never expect. Okay, see ya. Hum, what to do now? Join too, I guess. In mystery murder too. Beth, we have been known for years now. So. OMG, is he gonna propose to me? This will be the happiest day of my life. So can I have more Robux? What the? No, you have been asking for Robux so many times. I'm out of money, babe. Ugh, fine. Oh, Adam, didn't expect you to be here. Oh, oh, hey, Sharon. Hey, babe, who are you standing with? Babe, I'm his. She is my friend. Did you just call him, babe? Relax, she's just saying that. Do you want to play something, Sharon Bear? Of course. Sharon Bear? Um, can I join with you? No, let's go, Sharon. Um, what if Kate and Carol were trying to tell me the truth that he is using me? Adam is so suspicious, I have to spy on them. Oh god, when are you gonna break up with that brat, babe? I already did, but she kept crying and begging me. You know I only dated her because she's rich. Hehehe, <laughs> she's so stupid when she believes you. Oh my god, Kate and Carol were telling the truth the whole time. And I didn't believe them. Why am I so stupid? I need to see them right now. Susan, what are you doing here? Um, where is Carol? She goes get some rest. I can call her if you want. Okay, call her now. I need to tell you something. I'm here. What's up? Well, I want to apologize for not trusting you. I was so stupid, but now I know everything. He cheated on me, on you guys with his girl best friend. Oh, oh my, my god, god. Another, another girl? girl? This is unbelievable. I'm sorry again. We all forgive you, girl. So what should we do now? Confront him? Nah, let him be. This is enough for me. He will get the punishment soon. I think you're right. I'm too tired now. Should we meet each other in real life? Good, Good idea, idea, Kate. Kate. About a week later. So did you break up with him? I'm a bad too. Don't rush. Let me use him. You don't have use him anything. I'm rich. Sharon, I have a lot of money. Hum. Miguel, what are you doing with my Sharon? You are really stupid, Adam. Are you cheating on me? Of course, duh. I only date you because you can scam your stupid girlfriends, so I can have Robux too. Now I find a better and hotter boyfriend than you. Who is hotter than me? That will be Miguel. Hello, my friend, again. Haha, <laughs> Miguel is hotter than me. Your lover's taste has a problem. Well, I think I should break up with you. Goodbye, loser. Hey there, girl. Hey! Oh my god, you're such a great actor. What? What happened? Well, Sharon is my friend. She's our spy to get to know Adam. Wait, let me add Adam here. 
Hi, baby boy. What the? Why is everyone here? I forgot to mention, I'm a friend of Carol. So you were the one God set up the whole time, boy. What? This is your plan? Back in a week ago. Thank you for meeting me, Sharon. So what is it, Carol? You're dating with the guy named Adam, right? Yeah, what about him? He's a gold digger. He's used to date me and other two girls. So, that's his past. I'm not finishing the sentence. He dated at the same time and used us for robics. For real, that's wrong. I get it, so what do you want me to do to him now? There is a guy named Miguel. Fake date with him and that will make Adam break up with you. Okay. Now that's some plot twist I can't expect. You're such a gold digger. Goodbye. So long, jerk. Adam has been kicked out of the group chat. Well, just let him know what happened so we can kick him out again. Ha ha ha. He will be so mad right now, but I like it. You are really good friends I have. It's nothing, girls. We should show them the power of our kind. Don't mess with our girl. Well, I just suggest earlier that we should meet in real life. What do you say, Sharon? Of course. I'd love to meet everyone. Great. I will see you later. The end.